Scientists in Central America are using nuclear techniques to monitor hidden groundwater supplies to try to minimize the impacts of catastrophic droughts. Climate change is threatening water resources around the world. For example, water across Latin America and the Caribbean is declining in quantity and quality because of extreme weather and abrupt changes in the way land is being used. With water demand increasing, countries are often relying on their limited supplies of groundwater instead. But we don't know enough about these groundwater stocks how often they are naturally replenished, and how quickly they can be exhausted. Está inquietante eh, consumo de agua asociado con la ocurrencia de periodos secos más prolongados y frecuentes ha repercutido en una profundización de los niveles de agua subterránea, dificultando su acceso para, la, para los diferentes usuarios. The region that stretches down the Pacific coast from Mexico to Panama is known as the Central American Dry Corridor. As it has been struggling with droughts caused by climate change for at least 20 years. This has led to significant food insecurity in the region. Scientists there are using nuclear techniques to understand the water scarcity with support from the International Atomic Energy Agency. La utilización de isótopos estables y otros trazadores ambientales nos permiten entender el funcionamiento de nuestros cuerpos hídricos subterráneos. Esta información es vital para poder mejorar el manejo y la planificación ante la amenaza del cambio climático y la variabilidad climática que afronta la región del corredor seco centroamericano. Each water sample contains slightly different isotopes of oxygen and hydrogen depending upon the route it's taken through the water cycle. These isotopes can be measured using laser instruments to provide a fingerprint of that sample and learn how old it is, where it came from, and where it's been. Scientists can use this information to map groundwater reserves and see whether fresh water has been entering the system or whether we are draining ancient reservoirs that might not refill quickly enough. This information allows local authorities to better protect groundwater and the ecosystems they support. Si sabemos cómo responde nuestro sistema de aguas subterráneas al impacto de las sequías recurrentes, vamos a poder administrar nuestros recursos de manera sostenible.